representing your country is like I think the biggest accomplishment. Winning the class and seeing your national anthem playing and your flag going up. Like there's there's no feeling like it. It's all about horses. Uh, whether it's endurance, polo, racing, uh, show jumping, it's our culture, it's part of us. I'm very close with my cousin uh, Sheikha Mehta and uh, she's done everything. She's done karate, she's been to the Olympics, she's now doing polo and she's such an inspiration to me um, because of what she does for sports in the UAE. And, uh, I look up to her and my uncle as well for all the things he does in endurance, in uh, racing, in the racing world. So if I can do half of that for the show jumping world, I'd be really happy. We, we see a lot more now women getting involved, whether it's in business or sports, and that's something to be proud of. In uh, 2010, we won silver for the team and Silver as an individual. Um, we had uh, really good riders at the time, uh, Ramdil Dahami, which is my coach. Mm -hmm. uh, he won gold that year, and uh, Khaled Al Aid, uh, which is our chef to keep, he won bronze. So I was in the middle. I was really proud of myself. When you place among the best, it's a huge achievement. Riding in a team is basically, you'd push yourself harder than you would if you were doing it for yourself. In the Nations Cup, when I had the first fence down, um, normally I get really demoralized and just kind of want to give up. But I knew I had to keep going for my team and I had to ride better. And, you know, you, you push yourself a little bit harder because you don't want to let your team down. The riders that were with us on the team, they really made us feel comfortable. Like, I knew they had my back. They knew I had their back. The riding community is really small. Even though you're traveling, you kind of always see the same people. But what it teaches you is that riding is the same language in any country. All riders speak the same in the warm-up. We communicate the same way. That's a nice thing. What has to happen is uh, you have to keep your mind very clear. Um, you can't be distracted. You have to stay very focused and have a plan. Don't worry about anything that goes on. Trust yourself, trust your horse. Go in, know what you want to do, know what works for you and what doesn't, and, and take it one fence at a time. Don't worry, don't overthink everything. Don't think about the course as a whole. Just one fence at a time and you'll be fine. I'm a firm believer that you have to work hard for what you want and you have to love what you're doing no matter what. Uh, you have ups and downs, you just have to keep going. And yeah, the passion and love for the sport is something I'd like people to remember me for.